Hi viewers, today's topic is basic understanding of chromosomes, genes and DNA. We can start from a tissue. This is the tissue uh, in which a human body is made up of. And you know, a tissue is made up of a group of cells which is having similar structure that function together as a unit. Okay, this is the cell which is taken out from a tissue and inside the cell you can see several structures like mitochondria, microtubules, intermediate filaments, ribosomes etc. But for today's topic just focus on nucleus. Let's bring out nucleus from that cell. Okay, now we have taken out nucleus from the cell. Inside the nucleus, you can see nucleolus and tangled hair-like structures called chromatin. Please focus on this chromatin. Okay, but at the time of cell division, these chromatins becomes arranged in a classical form. Let's see what is this classical form called. In the previous slide, you have seen tangled hair-like structures called chromatins. But here, look inside the nucleus, there is no chromatin, but instead it becomes arranged in a classical or standard form. That standard form of chromatins are called chromosomes. Only at the time of cell division, we can see chromosomes. In other words, these chromosomes are formed to facilitate cell division. A cell can divide equally only by the formation of chromosomes. And these two strands are of chromosomes are called sister chromatids with joints at the center called syndromere. See, this is the chromosomes and each chromosomes are made up of units called genes. We can say chromosomes are made up of genes. Here we can see the chromosomes are made up of units called genes and inside the genes you can see several DNA molecules. In other words, genes are made up of DNA molecules. This is the DNA molecule composed of three units, deoxyribose sugar, phosphate and nitrogenous base. This blue shader region is the sugar phosphate backbone. The DNP stands for deoxyribose sugar and phosphate. And inside this nitrogenous base, nitrogenous base are adenine, guanine, thymine and cytosine. So, a DNA molecule is composed of three units, deoxyribose sugar, phosphate and nitrogenous base. This is the conclusion. Inside the cell, there is nucleus. Inside the nucleus, there is chromosome. Inside the chromosomes, units called genes. Inside the genes, DNA molecules. And inside the DNA molecules, there are three units. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.